How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the Green Dream Project. Now if you've seen our last video, you know we put up the joists over our earth bag root cellar. Then we want to get the subfloor on top of that to help protect the bags from the harsh sunlight we have out here in the desert. But first, before we do all that, what I want to do with this pipe is I want to bring it out and come up from outside of the building. So this is where the bags will lay for uh, the dome we're gonna build. And I want this to go underneath the bags, up and out of the building. So I'm gonna move some of this gravel, dig a little trench, and then alter the pipe a little bit. So that's just a tiny trench, just a few feet. No big deal for me. Now I'm gonna cut that pipe, run it across, then bring it back up. Made a little trip, picked this up at the local hardware store. They actually sell this ABS pipe by the foot, so that's kind of handy. Now we're pumping this thing outside. Just got to do a little backfilling here. We should be good to go. I know, more backfilling. That's what it's all about here. Digging holes and filling them back in. Yeah, simple as that. It's always nice knocking out them easy projects. <laughs> Look at this, not only does this lady build houses, what are you doing in here? <laughs> scrubbing, scrubbing clothes. Why are you doing this little like washboard, scrubbing things by hand thing? I already put it through our little washing machine, but it's, it's can't handle the level of dirt that's on here, so I'm doing a little hand washing. That's always nice when you get those easy projects like that radon pipe. That wasn't too bad. Now, all day yesterday, I pretty much spent leveling these boards. I did not think it would take that long. It was definitely a little bit of a challenge. It took a lot of work. I guess you don't realize just how off a little bit, just going around the circumference of those bags, just kind of how wavy everything is. Everything kind of needed to be adjusted a little bit. There's only so much I can do to really lower any of the joists. So I went to the tallest joist, the one that was up the highest, and then I based all my other measurements off of that. And then what I proceeded to do was then level that out going along the joist. Then I went across and just leveled each joist compared to that first one. So I would go across starting from that tallest joist, go to the next one, making sure that was level, then making sure that next joist was level from back to front. And it's going down the line, side to side, front to back. So it occurred to me that I still have to do one more stair. Otherwise we're talking about like over a one foot drop from the OSB down to the first step. That's not gonna work. And I also gotta get things done because the boss man right there is looking at me. He's watching out, making sure I get everything done, so. Oh, I, guess, I guess he's more concerned about what mom was doing now. <laughs> the pressure's off. Flame on! Woo! Enough out of you. <laughs> so I got my pouch on. You know, when I got the pouch, I mean business. I gotta put in another step. Otherwise, there'd be over a foot drop from the floor to the first step we have in now. And I'm lucky because my air compressor and my air compressor hose reaches all the way over here. So that is, that's real nice. So I'm gonna attach the stair, make sure all the joists are still where I put them, and then cinch everything down. Look at that. Just brought me a snack. Hard working man. She didn't bring that. She didn't bring that. <laughs> Checking to see what I'm doing out here. 
The last step in, what do you think? It doesn't look good yet. That, that's not how it's going to end up being. Oh. <laughs> it's just kind of hanging down all limply. But it will look good. It will look good soon. He's ready for a ride. <laughs> hmm. While we were out picking up some supplies, I picked up some of these joist hangers. I think this will be uh, real nice for bracing up some of these joists. Got a couple of boards already, especially I want a couple here along the stairwell. But I'm going to add a couple of rows going right down the center. What's up, girl? How you doing? You working late again? Let's try to get this done. I'm excited to get to that OSB. Everything takes longer than you think though. Unfortunately, I didn't get that done last night. So, knock the rest of this out this morning real quick. I only got two more boards to go after this, I think. So, and then I want to screw in the end of each of the joists into those cleats. Get everything cinched in real well. Oh, he knows you got, he knows you got things in your pocket. 
It's mine. <laughs> it's my doodles. You sit. That was so scary. <laughs> That's it. And we also discovered this this morning. Must have happened when we were going for supplies. Living in the country. Seems like this seems to happen every week. You need to get a tire repaired. And I haven't had a chance to really look at the truck, so that's just been kind of sitting there. I kind of want to get this done first. I feel like I'm in a time crunch. And I want to get the, those bags covered, so. I'll have to get this fixed soon, because this is our only transportation, and I'll have to deal with the truck when, uh, whenever I got a few minutes. Oh! So I got all my bracing in, looking real good. The last thing I'm gonna do is shore up each of these joists by placing one of these screws inside at the end of each joist. And uh, that should lock in the ends. So then I'll have the middle secure, the ends will be secure, and then uh, I think we'll be ready for uh, the OSB. Crew needs another walk. Last one, last board. Worked out nice. That's it, that's all she wrote. Wow, that was still a decent amount of work, just uh, bracing up all the joists, uh, getting everything leveled. Uh, it took me a while to even figure out just how I was gonna go about leveling everything. Uh, it was just a little tricky <laughs> trying to figure out how to do it on the medium of the earth bags. But uh, it's, everything's looking really good right now. I think we're just about ready for that OSB. By the way, we're pushing our video back. We did lives on Thursdays. And then we had a video Fridays. I think we're gonna push that Friday video back to Saturday. And that'll just give a little breathing room for the live. So it'll be video Tuesday, live Thursday, another video Saturday. So stay tuned for that. Otherwise, we'll catch you guys on the next video. Later, bye.